Possibly the largest break in the search for Malaysian Airlines Flight 370, Australian officials announced satellites may have spotted two pieces of debris in the Indian Ocean. Australia's Department of Defense has released these two satellite images of debris, two objects which may be related to the missing flight. One of the pieces of debris thought to be as large as 78 feet long. The original search zone was over 2,000 kilometers southwest of Perth, an area the size of Victoria. The debris has been identified just south of that and a new search sector established. Sky News reports the satellite images were taken on Sunday and it took some time to analyze the pictures. While networks all call this a potentially huge break, officials have worked to temper expectations. The objects may have moved in the last several days. All the while uh, hedging uh, and applying a number of caveats saying that this is an area where currents meet, where maritime debris can congregate. But for all that, it is a new lead. The Australian Maritime Safety Authority just minutes ago, they tweeted the crew has been unable to locate any debris. That's thanks partly to limited visibility because of rain and clouds. Carrying 239 people, Flight 370 disappeared two weeks ago with little to no hard evidence on where it presumably went down. Authorities in the last few days announced it's possible someone deliberately diverted the aircraft off its flight path. Investigators are also trying to recover files they believe one of the flight's pilots deleted from his homemade flight simulator. The Malaysian transport minister told reporters, every lead is a hope. This time, I just hope it's a positive development. Early Thursday morning, a Norwegian cargo ship was the first to arrive in the search area and said it would stay there to assist as long as necessary. For Newsy, I'm Cliff Judy.